Yeah, so it's your brother Bolo V and I, we in the building again, man. This gonna be a very quick reaction to a YouTube clip, not a YouTube. This is gonna be a very quick reaction to a Instagram clip that I saw and what this lady was saying was very interesting and I think it should spark a lot of conversation in the comment section and, and, and also a little bit of research. Uh, because basically she's speaking on a word and she's going deep diving into the root of the word and just linguistics and all of that and you know the Bible speaks about the power of the tongue and the word and how powerful that is right so we can't discount how powerful the, your utterance from your mouth it, it I think it's important for us to know the meaning of words so we can exercise the power through speech. But if we are using words that are counterproductive to the development of our lives as human beings, um, we wonder why we are in certain predicaments that we are in, right? So I just want you to open up your mind um, to what this lady is saying, do your research, and let me know what y'all think in the comment section initially based off what she's talking about, man. Let's get it. Check this out. When you look up the word bad and you get into the brackets, and how many of you have sons or know people that have sons that say, man, that show is a bad little boy. Do not ever call any little melanated boy bad. The word bad means effeminate and hermaphroditic. Get in the brackets. The word bad means a hermaphrodite or womanish man. Is that what you see in the dictionary? Yeah. The, the scriptures say, ask and you shall receive. You speak it out and you make it reality because you spoke it into existence. And this is something that dark skinned people have the power to do. He kept saying, I'm bad, you know it. <laughs> and today, he's bad, and you know it. And you know it. All right, so you heard it in its entirety. Now I'm going to go through it and pause and, 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 and give my reaction. When you look up the word bad and you get into the brackets, and how many of you have sons or know people that have sons that say, man, that show is a bad little boy. Do not ever call any little melanated boy bad. The word bad means effeminate and hermaphroditic. The word bad means effeminate or hermaphroditic. Okay, I'm going to go to Google. Maybe Google is not the best place, but let me find out right here. Bad and meaning. Let me see if there's any. Um, okay. Let me scroll up right here. Uh, a poor quality or a low standard. Substandard, poor, inferior, second rate, second class. Not such as to be hoped for or desired, unpleasant or unwelcome. Um, he beat her badly, blah, 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 blah. All right, so even if, even if you want to say that she's reaching, which I don't know for sure. I know some people might have that in their mind to say that she's reaching when she say bad means this. Um... Based off what bad is meaning here, why do we, why do women call themselves, I'm a bad bee? Why do women do that? Why do men say, why do men say, you know I'm a bad man, you know I'm a bad boy. Why do we take that on and, and speak that into our lives when it says a poor quality or a low standard? So all the ladies that are talking about they bad bees, you are a poor quality and a low standard B. That's what it means. All right? Not such as to be hoped for or desired. You are undesirable. You are unpleasant. You are unwelcome. This is the meaning of the word bad. So why are you calling yourself bad bees? Right? I want y'all to think about that and let me know. You know, I don't know where she got the definition from. That's what I'm saying. 
what she's speaking on in my opinion is deeper linguistics which you would have to be a scholar in that area to look those things up to find out the root word i'm gonna try i'm gonna try and do it right here on google root word for bad all right the latin root word mal means bad or evil the root is the word origin of many English vocabulary words including malform, maltreat, and malice. You can recall that mal means bad through malfunction or badly working parts and that it means evil through malice or intentional evil done to, to, to another. Now, with this, with this right here, this doesn't help the case of why we use the word bad. This right here further, uh, you know, encourages me to not refer to myself or people that I love in this manner as bad because all of the meanings are negative. So these bad bees and these bad boys and bad men, um, yeah. You're doing yourself a disservice and your child, you know, word sound and power. So with that said, let me go back. Get in the brackets. The word bad means a hermaphrodite or womanish Woman. man. Did she say Hold on, let me see some of these comments. Let me see some of these comments. I think she said it. I think she said it. Where where she actually got it from, the meaning. But because of the music, I missed it. Is that what you see in the dictionary? Yeah. The, the, the scripture say, ask and you shall receive. You speak it out and you make it reality because you spoke it into existence. And this is something that dark-skinned people have the power to do. He kept saying, I'm bad, you know it, <laughs> and today, he's bad, and you know it. And you know that. When you look up the word bad and you get into the brackets, and how many of you have sons? It says pronunciation equal vibration, okay. Or I know people that have sons that say, man, that show is a bad little boy. Do not ever call any little melanated boy bad. The word bad means effeminate and hermaphroditic. Get in the brackets. The word bad means a hermaphrodite or womanish. In the brackets? In the brackets? What does that mean? What does bad mean in the in the bra in the graphic? Oh shit! Here's the definition of bad. No, 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 of no, no, poor no. quality or What does standard. bad mean in the brackets? I'm trying to figure. Well, right, let me move on from that. <laughs> I don't know where she got a definition from, but like I said. Y'all let me know what y'all think about this, man. Like, I, like my, my disposition is this. Yes, you know, um, it is, it is um, the meaning of the word that she's saying. I don't know if she can verify that. But, of course, just the meaning of the word bad in itself. Like I said before, why do we use that so much to describe ourselves? as melanated people and it's not just us that do it a lot of other races do but we are the ones that are the pioneers the girls talking about that i'm a bad b i'm a bad b dudes talking about i'm a bad boy i'm a bad man like that's cool when when are we gonna shift our our focus and our psyche to the point where we start incorporating positive things and speak that in our lives instead of us taking on all the negatives and we wonder why we are in the situations that we're in just a thought just something to think about but like i said let me know what y'all think in the comment section of this video when it's premiered 
And if you made it to the end, I want to say thank you so much for your time. And even if you didn't, thank you as well for however little time you came on here and um, watched the video for. And if you're hearing me right now, I want to invite you, if you didn't see the entirety of it, go ahead and press replay. The replay button is your friend. And let me know what you think in the comment section. Like, share, and if you're not yet a part of the community, subscribe. And of course, um, if you want to support the channel, you can donate. The donation links is in my uh, channel description. Just click on the channel and you'll see all the links. Subscribe to all my three channels, Bolo VNR, Bolo VNR 2.0, and Bolo Clips. Alright, that's my time. See y'all on the next one.